Hello, I'm using the Daily Dish theme by Studio Press. I'm going to set up the home page section. Now, the bit we're setting up is this bit here. And when you first install the theme, you'll either see nothing there, or you might see most recently posted blog posts. So what we need to do, obviously you'll need some, uh, you'll need some posts already inside your site to make this work. So what we're going to do, Go to appearance in your dashboard, go to appearance, customize, and we want to deal with the widgets. So in the customizer, click the little arrow where the widgets are, and we're going to deal with home top. So click that one, click add a widget, and to the home top widget area, we're going to add Genesis featured posts widget, not the featured page widget, the featured posts widget. We're going to call it, oh, to give it a title of Featured Dish. We're going to choose a category of salads. I'm using the, um, the Studio Press demo content, but if you've got, um, if you've got your own content, then obviously you'll choose the, the category that's that's relevant to you. I'm going to show one post. I'm going to show the post title and info. I'm going to choose show content. And that's all the settings we need with this um, top widget. So I'm going to close that one. We're going to do the next one. Is home middle. Alright, so we do the, virtually the same thing in home middle. Click add a widget. We're going to add a Genesis featured posts widget. We're going to label this section featured dinners. We're going to choose a category of meals. Two posts to show. And this one we're going to show the featured image. And we're going to choose the size for the featured image of 320 by 200. We're going to show the title and info. And we're going to set a content limit in this one. So content type. Set a uh, Set content limit, show content limit, and we're going to have 150 characters, and then we're going to save it. Ah, when you're using the uh, the customizer, you don't need to save till you click this save and publish button up here. So that's that one done. Now we're going to do home bottom, and we do do just the same with this one. We've opened the home bottom widget area. Click add a widget. Genesis featured post widget. We're going to add a title. Desserts. We're going to have a category of desserts. I show three posts. Going to show featured image that's 150 square and aligned left. Show featured image 150 square that one we want and align left. We're going to show the title and info. We're going to show content limit of 110. So show content limit 110. And then we're going to save and publish. Close the widget box and we'll see what's happened to our page. We'll just close the customizer and we can see what's going on. So we'll go back to our page, refresh it. And this is what we've added. We've added this uh, section at the top. Then we added the whole middle section and the home bottom section. Now this one here, 
works in a slightly different way. This read more bit here works in a slightly different way to the other two. So we'll just have a look at that post. So if we view the post, edit it. On this one, what we did, we chose to have the more tag, more tag there. And whenever you put one of these more tags in, in your blog style listings, it will only show up to this more, more tag here. And the way you do that, you just choose where you want it to break, put your cursor in, and you use insert read more tag there. And then, when you view the page on the home page, it only shows up to that read more tag. Then you get the, the little link there. Well, that's it for the main section of the home page. We'll move on.